A fitting backdrop for a game of massive significance. The stage is set, a packed house at the ready, awaiting two teams who like nothing better than to test themselves on a stage like this. The tricky part is predicting which side will outfox the other. It's Newcastle United, they take on Borussia Dortmund, and the action is next on EA TV Live. Hello and a warm welcome to a stadium that always oozes passion, St James's Park. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It's Newcastle United, Almiron, fine goalkeeping to push that away. So the starting 11 for Newcastle United. Nick Putt gets the nod between the posts. Bruno Guimaraes plays alongside Sandro Tonali in central midfield. And the attack is led today by Alexander Isak. And here's the 11 for Borussia Dortmund. Well, it's great to see a team playing with wingers in a 4-3-3. But they've got to be effective, both with their dribbling and their crosses. Otherwise, they'll become bit part players. on for that challenge Marco Royce and options in the centre and he clears it out of harm's way Sandro Tonali into the advanced position to the box it might still be problematic Dortmund have been awarded the free kick by the referee <laughs> distributing it well of support here could be dangerous and he's made the run and it goes the opening goal in this context well that's a clinical finish he just put his head down and smashed it past the keeper there was no stopping that was there you down to the ground happy to shoot still alive must be well that was a guilt-edged opportunity for the equalizer well i'm not sure how he's missed the target from there that's a poor effort with it now options in the centre angles it back crucial intervention just then amid impending danger Emery Chan has given it away Isaac will he shoot the fans hope so 
Really good build up, but no end product. Julian Riosom. A lot of space afforded Borussia Dortmund. Well, the cross was acceptable, but no one there to thump at home. Isaac. Tonali with it. Danger here as he runs at them. Timely intervention. Now well, breaking at pace is always a possibility. And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Dimaraish. Joe Linton. Opportunity here. And danger still. And effectively parried away by the keeper. The corner to the Magpies as they try to press home their advantage. Taken short. Cross could be useful. Now, will the keeper have to pay the price for that mistake? And nearing the break, Newcastle hold the edge. Stewart, what have you made of the performance? Yes, they're defending really well all over the pitch. Their work rate and discipline has been excellent. But any drop in tempo and this lead could easily slip away. Anthony Gordon. Oh, good play, this. Joe Linton. Can he finish this? Well, he had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. <laughs> Playing it in. Not the most confident clearance. And that's it, we've reached the halfway point here at St. James's Park. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. to the second half and as far as Borussia Dortmund are concerned it's all about bouncing back Joel Linton Emre Can loses out they were playing fluid football but then the foul and now you would anticipate a yellow card And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Good ball over the top. Wasn't messing around with the clearance. Oh, he looks threatening. Who can he pick out? It should be. And there it is. A two-goal cushion now. And they just need to keep the concentration. Well, let's look at this.
this again. He's done superbly well to pick out a teammate here, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, he looks really pleased, doesn't he? His side has been really good today. And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Rami Ben Sabaini. Able to skip past his man. Well, that's a very poor effort, dearie me. Well, he's made a mess of that. That's a wasted opportunity. And Dortmund will go to the bench. of closing down now who can he play it to well disappointing end to the move this might be ideal for the counter acres of space for the magpies of running room players waiting in the center determined defending a well, very effective play in possession Brandt well he stumped it out of there without much fuss Isaac Tonali with it. Well, spot on with that challenge. Rice might go for teamwork. And that is how to block. Chan. Running with the ball confidently. Couldn't grab hold of it. One terrific save after another. with Isaac Isaac looked like a certain goal but that's a great challenge 15 minutes left for play can pull one back here oh really commanding goalkeeping Nicely timed tackle. Can he find the right pass? Can he finish? And tipping it over the crossbar. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Over it comes, and dealt with it nicely. Who's Chan? Firing it in. Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to stop it. Of resilience there. And so into the final five minutes. Isaac. He 
attack. This could be troublesome. A matter of keeping his composure. And a goal to put the final stamp on it. That will do it. Well, let's take another look. And you have to say, the defending is so poor. That's far too easy. The keeper had no chance there. Sebastian Allaire. Well, totaling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. Textbook defending inside the box. Well, it clearly was deflected, so it will be their throw in. So, full time it is, and a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European campaign. Yeah, that's a good win and a vital three points. Another win next time out, and they'll be in a great position. Well, he put in a really thorough performance here, Stuart. Well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today, and of course, he scored two really good goals.